as storm-ravaged communities in Georgia and North Carolina cry out for help, a political battle ignites. Former President Trump accuses the White House of ignoring the devastation, an accusation swiftly debunked by Governor Kemp, who confirms President Biden's full support. With lives at stake, Biden fires back, calling Trump's claims a dangerous lie. In the midst of destruction, who will the people believe? Good evening, today we ray focusing on the unfolding political drama surrounding the aftermath of the recent storm that hit the U.S. in the midst of efforts to provide relief, misinformation, and political tensions are complicating the situation. Let us dive into what happened. Yesterday, former President Donald Trump visited Georgia and falsely claimed that the White House, under President Biden, was ignoring the state and its Republican governor, Brian Kemp, particularly in their storm relief efforts. Trump alleged that Governor Kemp had been struggling to reach the president, accusing the federal government of being unresponsive. However, this claim was swiftly debunked by Governor Kemp himself. Kemp confirmed that he had indeed spoken with President Biden, who had offered his full support and federal resources. Kemp expressed his appreciation for the president's responsiveness, stating that they were working through the necessary processes for federal aid. President Biden later addressed Trump's accusations, becoming visibly frustrated. He called Trump's claims an utter lie and emphasized that the administration was doing everything possible to assist the affected communities. Biden stressed that spreading such misinformation could discourage people from seeking help, which could have devastating consequences. Political commentators pointed out the danger of Trump's statements, suggesting that they were not just exaggerations, but complete fabrications. They warned that in a time of crisis when people are desperate for assistance, misleading information can undermine relief efforts. Vice President Kamala Harris also announced plans to visit the affected areas in the coming days, but emphasized that she did not want to distract from the ongoing recovery efforts. In times of natural disasters, political differences should take a backseat to human needs. Both President Biden and Governor Kemp are focused on ensuring the necessary aid reaches those in need, regardless of their political affiliation. As always, it's important to seek out accurate information to ensure that relief efforts remain effective and timely. Stay informed and let us hope for a swift recovery for all affected.